climate change. It's not the biggest issue facing the animals of the world today. We are. Climate change has always been the dominant evolutionary force, moulding the animals into what they are, amazing creatures that are perfectly adapted for their environment, but with the ability to evolve further. The animals can cope with climate change, but they can't cope with us as well. Currently, there are 7 billion people on this planet, and 8.5 million species of animals, meaning that right now, our world exists in a delicate state of balance. But we are intruding on nature to lift ourselves higher, tipping the scales. And as our population grows to an estimated 9 billion people by the year 2050, we're going to intrude even more, tipping the scales even further. Those people are going to need fed and housed, which involves forests being cut down to make farmland and urban areas. Already one and a half acres of forest are cut down every second. Deforestation is the destruction of habitats. That's animals, homes, food and food supplies and is a leading cause of extinction. By the end of the century, 28,000 species of animals are expected to be extinct because of it. We have also unbalanced ecosystems by introducing new species into habitats that don't belong in. These provide competition and predators for the natives. We can see the effect of that here in New Zealand with our possum problem. Poaching is also weeding out genetics that maximise an individual's chances of survival, meaning only the DNA of the weak is left. This unbalancing of nature is all for sport and money. Across the globe, we're seeing a reduction in biodiversity as humans dominate the planet, affecting food chains and genetic diversity and reducing animals' chances of successfully adapting to climate change and increasing their chances of extinction. And when the animals become extinct, we will too, as a result of the delicate balance between animals, their environments, weather systems and us. This is why I believe that conservation and a better understanding of Earth's ecosystems is important so that we can prevent mass extinctions from happening. I think that studying a Bachelor of Science at Lincoln University, majoring in Ecology and Conservation, will help prepare me to participate in finding innovative ways of overcoming the challenges that climate change, a growing human population, present, and help restore nature to its original balance.